You might think you know Google Docs well, but there are lots of hidden and valuable features that you may not be using. So watch this video till the end where we will show you how you can replace text, share download links in PDF format, and much more. Starting off, let's see how you can change the default font style in Google Docs. By default, it's Arial, and seriously, it's kind of boring. If you want to change it, simply highlight this entire line and select the desired font. Next, go to Format, Paragraph Style, Normal Text and click on Update Normal Text to Match. Again, go to Format, Paragraph Styles, Options and select Save as my default styles. As you can see, it says your default styles have been changed, you can confirm that by opening a new document. Next, Google Doc feature is ideal for lazy people who don't want to create a new document from scratch. You can find this from File, New, from Template and choose any of the pre-made templates based on your specific need. It will save you tons of time on what would have been otherwise spent on documents formatting and adjusting the font and color schemes. Google has been adding really cool stuff to Docs lately and its new smart chips are seriously mind-blowing. With this feature, you never have to hunt around for a tool in the menu bar ever again. All you have to do is type add symbol within Docs and you'll see a drop-down menu with all these smart chip suggestions. You can quickly mention someone, search files, add dates, checklist, change the heading and many more without going anywhere. And apart from looking great, everything you tag becomes very dynamic. Tip number 7. You can check who made changes to a document using version history. For example, if someone makes some changes to your shared docs, you can go to File, Version History and see all the version history. From here, choose the version history you want to revert back to and click Restore this version. If you're creating a Google Doc that includes hierarchical formatting like different headings, you can generate an automatic outline to structure your document. To do this, go to View and then select Show Outline. Aside from that, you can also write a summary. From now on, whenever someone opens a document, they can quickly navigate through complex documents and read the summary. Tip number 5. You can auto-replace text in Google Docs using substitutions. You can find this tool from Tools, Preferences and Substitutions. From here, you can type a little snippet and replace it with a long sentence or phrase. So now, if you type the small snippet and hit the space on keyboard, it will automatically change to this. Awesome, right? Another hidden feature you can use in Google Docs is creating a document using your voice. To do this, go to the Tools menu and select Voice Typing. It will ask permission to use a microphone, so allow it. Now you can place this little window anywhere you want, click this microphone icon and start dictating. If you want someone to download your document directly in PDF format, you can do that too. Simply change the last word in the URL to export, question mark, format, equal sign, PDF. Next, copy the link and send it to them. Now, when they open this link, a PDF of the same document will start downloading. By default, Google Docs does not give you a real-time word count of your document. To enable this, go to the Tools and select Word Count option. A window will pop up, make sure display word count while tapping is on and hit OK. As you can see, you have the word count at the bottom left of the screen. The last Google Docs feature on today's list is that you can embed a document within an email. This feature is helpful when you need your boss to review your document without downloading the file. To do this, go to File, Email and email this file. Now, check on send yourself a copy, type the email address, write something in the message if you want and make sure to check this box where it says Don't Attach. Finally, click Send and this is how it looks on their email. 
So, that was all about the 10 hidden Google Doc features you should know. Thanks for watching. If you found this video to be helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.